What's good, YouTube? It's our boy Young Cow, and I'm back with another video. Today, video we're gonna talk about the Cleveland uh, white woman that was found on fleet inside a garage. Now, look. If you look at her picture, she looked like uh, Bruno. She don't look like a regular like uh, note, like a regular crackhead white girl. She looked like she could have been like. Um, feel me a person that was just looking for like a, a, a white person that just wanted a party or something and that was looking for drugs and she ended up finding the drugs and you know overdosing on the drugs but they said it, she wasn't shot or nothing but you feel me she was found in the garage so you never know what she was doing you feel me she could have been on that fitting all or something like that you feel me and she and then you gotta think about it she looked like she was from like the suburbs of Cleveland, like from fucking Medina or something like that, Twinsburg or something, something like that. You, you see what I'm saying? So, you feel me? What was her purpose on Fleet? Y'all know, y'all from Cleveland, Fleet is known, that's the, you feel me? That's basically crackhead area. That's the, I mean, that's the, I mean, that's what that shit is all about over there. You see what I'm saying? So, I was just trying to figure out what what was she going over there? Ain't, the, ain't you know, most white people that be over there is really, they strung out. You see what I'm saying? They strung out on drugs. So that's the only thing I could think of. She was over there looking for some drugs. You know, probably some, you know, some ecstasy, some pills, some Percocets. No, uh, and shit like that. Hell, maybe even just some weed. You see what I'm saying? She might have got some weed that was mixed with fentanyl, something like that. Cause you know, fentanyl that hit the market so bad that you know people them put it in the weed and all this other stuff, and now it's just killing people overdosing. So you feel me? They say she was found in the garage. So she, you know, you feel me? So she probably, you know, was over there and you feel me, you know, doing her thing or whatever and then end up passing out. Whoever was with her was like, who, who never know, she might have been by herself or, you know, I don't know, if whoever served her or whatever, I don't know, I don't know. They probably just like, oh, what the fuck? Got the fuck on, or shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Cleveland, Cleveland grind me like that. But notice how all the news camera and all that other stuff was out there quick, quick, quick. They was out there quick when they said, you know, it was a white girl on fleet, you know, dead in the garage. But when it comes to us, like black people, you know, they don't, they don't really care and stuff like that. I mean, black people have been found in the garage, abandoned buildings and stuff like that. Them people don't even really care. But, like I said, man, that, that, that white girl was not, she wasn't just like a regular crackhead. She wasn't like a crackhead white girl. Like, you, you can tell crackhead, meth heads and all that white people. She wasn't like that. Like I said, she probably either met up with somebody that was cool, feel me, that she felt was cool and all this other shit, stuff like that. And then they probably served her she just OD off the, off the drugs or whatever they gave her, feel me? I don't know who did it, none of that. That ain't my business, none of that. But I'm just saying, look, look at her picture. That's all I'm saying. But look at her picture, you can tell that she's not just like a regular, like, crackhead white person. That's all I'm saying. So, feel me? She, she looked like she was like a college student that just was looking so hard and just ended up on fleet. But, man, y'all gotta stay away from them. Y'all gotta stay away from them drugs, man. Stuff it's getting crazy out here, bro. This is why, you feel me, I don't, everybody here, like, I don't, you feel me, I don't, I don't deal with, with everybody when it comes to smoking and all that. You 
don't know what people are putting in shit nowadays. People are putting hella stuff in it nowadays, bro. I swear, like, they're putting everything in there, you know. Fentanyl is the number one killer right now, bro. Fentanyl got murdered. I'm saying, like, Fentanyl got gun violence. I think Fentanyl got gun violence. I'm not sure about it. If, if Fentanyl don't got it, got gun violence, they, they neck and neck but man y'all be safe out here stop doing drugs so i'm saying shout boy young cow 216 like comment subscribe do all that and i'm out